hi welcome back to my channel my name is Kadeen if you're new here welcome it's been quite a while since I filmed a long form YouTube video I've been hanging out in the comfort of YouTube shorts but I want to start practicing my long form video editing skills so we are back we are back a lot has changed I've moved to a new apartment and I'm now a fifth year PhD candidate um, the semester started about a month ago and yeah, I just filmed a couple of days in my life, uh, a couple of chill, productive days. I am a big advocate for holistic health, so taking care of your mental, spiritual, and physical um, well-being. I go by the holistic health nut on Instagram. Feel free to follow me there if you would like. I'll have it linked in the description box. Um, but yeah, I also have a blog called The Holistic Health Nut, will also be linked in the description box. But if you're new here, please consider subscribing, share this video with a friend, and I hope that you enjoyed today's video. It's just a couple of days in my life, just to kind of get my feet wet again in the whole um, long form video. I highly recommend turning on post notifications so that you'll be notified each time I post a video. Um, but yeah, welcome to my life. Let's get into it. <laughs> So I'm gonna quickly eat some lunch. I have some beef bulgogi that I kind of heated up on the stove. I'm gonna put some kimchi in there. I'm gonna eat this really quick, drink some Earl Grey tea, and then head out. Quickly. Some fermented cabbage, good for your gut health. I'll give you all that. Healthy microbes. This one's a spicy version. It is so hot in here. This is a very interesting angle. But it's the only angle where my phone isn't going flying and I have to put safe driving first so hopefully you guys are fine hanging out right there for now but it is so hot in here sheesh okay so we're heading to the farmer's market my plan is to only be there for one hour so I want to get back to my apartment by at least 1.30 such a sunny day so we love that forgot to bring sunglasses i thought i had sunglasses in the car but i guess not so i'm gonna have to deal with the sun <sighs> but yeah i'm so tired i could cry like i, I feel so exhausted I'm gonna go to bed early tonight actually because I am super tired. <sighs> yeah, I think when I come home from the grocery store, I have notes that I need to make on the paper. 
paper for the student and mentoring. And then I have the meeting at three o'clock. And that meeting ends at four. And then my plan is to head to lab so I can get there by 4.30. I have a couple things on the list, but I don't think it should take me more than an hour. So when that's done, yeah, when I get home, I'm just gonna chill for the rest of the day. And it's the um, union workers are protesting. Um, so they've been out here for the past week. They're still here today. But yeah, so I'm gonna just chill for the rest of the day because I'm so tired, I'm so tired, but I just need to get these things done. I'm really grateful to past me though because all my laundry is done except for my sheets but I can just do that today. Um, yeah, when I get back I'll do that and then by the time I get home they should be all dried and then I can just put them back on the bed and just plant my body into the mattress. Um, but yeah, happy Saturday. It's a glorious day outside. It's pretty sunny which I enjoy. I should be at the market in the next maybe 10 minutes or so. Uh, but one other thing that I want to finish before the weekend is over. So I'm just gonna move that to tomorrow and just try to knock it out in like three hours. Um, yeah, and then get myself organized and ready. spot that I parked in is a parking spot but I'm gonna take it anyway um I have this little bag for my peaches peaches are in season right now so I want to get a bunch of them and then I have a Trader Joe's tote bag I should probably bring another um reusable bag in case this can't fit everything yeah I'm gonna head inside and my phone is dying so okay we'll see you soon I'm back home. It was a really quick, successful trip. So let me show you the produce that I picked up. So I got some tomatoes, some kale. Squash is in season right now, so I got some honey nut squash. This is one of my favorite ones. Half of a watermelon. Eggplant. The rest of my tea from this morning. Um, we got some baby bok choy, some cucumbers. Uh, some basil it smells really really amazing potatoes beets carrots peppers onions and some baby tomatoes I also got some cilantro as well yeah so I'm just gonna wash these put them away and then start working on um, preparing for my 3 p.m. meeting <laughs> stick them in the fridge um but yeah so i'm gonna just hop in bed finish editing that paper and then join my meeting i'm gonna have the meeting in bed because i'm so tired my body needs to like relax
my student is late to the meeting. He just emailed me that he's having connectivity issues. So just gonna wait a little bit more. Enjoy the sun, get some vitamin D. Oh, you see that glow? Yes. Donde estas? Oh, also I want to practice my Spanish because it's been years since I practiced Spanish. I always like go on and off. Um, but I took um, Spanish for three years in high school and I want to be a, a bilingual girly so I'm gonna if you hear me break out into Spanish in this vlog don't be alarmed I'll probably put um, subtitles in case I do but yeah also the sun on my skin mm, mm, mm. okay Hello. Ah, oh, not the cloud. I've got sunshine on a cloudy day. When it's cold outside, something in the month of May. Well, I guess you say what can make me feel this way. Sunshine, sunshine, talking about sunshine, sunshine. Okay, enough. Oh, I was also eating this popcorn. Popcorn is one of my favorite snacks. Eat. and this one has been a recent favorite from Trader Joe's it's the herbs and spices one I also really like the sweet and salty one from um, Boom Chicken Pop anyways my meeting is starting hello 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 so I just took a look and put in comments for the remaining sections that I missed. We haven't fully discussed the discussion and so on yet. It's a brief introduction, probably like four or so sentences, right? And then you go into the objective of your paper, which is your, your question. So you're restating the question that... Remember your abstract is telling the reader what the paper is about, right? So more succinct. Um, and kind of flow a little bit better. It's used to so I just finished my meeting. Still a tired lump of clay. I'm about to go throw some pants on and drive up to the lab. Let's get it. But first, let's put these guys away.
I did my sheets, I washed them, put them on the bed, took a shower, moisturized my hair again for today, and then just tied it up in this. It's about to be 4 p.m. Um, I have to go by the lab later, but I'm just charging my phone and my iPad so that I can use them when I get there. So while they're charging, I'm going to plan my schedule for the week and organize my to-do lists and then just lay around and chill until it's time to go. Um, I'm hoping that I can be done with whatever I'm doing in an hour at least. Um, yeah, so that's the plan. And then for the rest of the day, I'll just be relaxing. I want to do my nails and my toes. So I'm going to do that later on before I go to bed. But yeah, happy Sunday. Hope you're having a lovely, or I guess by the time you're seeing this, it will no longer be the weekend. But I hope you're having a wonderful day or night whenever you're watching this. But the sun is coming out um, today. It's going to be sunny tomorrow as well. Um, and then it's going to be like sort of raining the rest of the week. I need to get gas for my car, so I'm going to do that today. And then I think I need to stop by Target to pick up a couple of things. And then I need to prepare my lunch for the next couple of days. Maybe I might meal prep some breakfast as well. I want to get an early start tomorrow, so I want to get to campus. Um, by 9 because I have a pretty long experiment day tomorrow so yeah that's my plan for that so I think I might actually prep some overnight oats for tomorrow morning yeah that might help so I can just have breakfast on the go as opposed to like setting aside time to make breakfast um, yeah I also want to get in a long walk today but time has gotten away from me so I really spent most of the morning cleaning um and having like some time with god yeah so we're gonna chill i'll probably pick you guys back up when i'm in the lab and then yeah but the footage that i have so far i'm gonna edit it while i wait for my devices to charge and finish planning my schedule for the week but yeah my hair is looking nice and moisturized um yeah, I'm looking forward to taking it out and having my curly fro tomorrow. So, fingers crossed it looks good. Um, but yeah, I will see y'all when we get to lab later. Bye!
the oats really sucked up all of the, <laughs> the oat milk. I'm actually going to make some later because I'm all out of oat milk right now. I finished, finished it yesterday. Also, what? I hate the black parts. I don't like when there are bruises on the banana. So I'm actually going to take that off. Yeah, I don't like that. Okay, and then I'm gonna and this half I'm gonna eat. So we got our banana slices and some almond butter. Honestly, banana with any kind of nut butter is always an elite combo. So this is how my hair came out. I kind of like it. Um, got my oatmeal. Um, it's like 8.30 right now. And then I also have this dress because I'm going to play tennis later. Um, and I have my racket and stuff in the back. Gonna, I think I'm gonna eat my oats while. <laughs> um, I think I need to get a trim though to kind of like get the shape to be a little bit better. Yeah, but. Happy Monday. I'm not gonna film while I'm in lab. So next time I'll see you will be when I'm playing tennis. So, bye.